So further to our carburetor overhaul, um, remember we looked at how the jet had fallen down and generally what will happen with the jet is the spring will rot away. Well that's really interesting because as we took the float tops off, can you see the rust in there look? The rust that's gone all the way down there which indicates that each one of the bowls is getting water into them. And it's um, very interesting and that rust obviously is on the top thread. The other thing is take a look at the height of the bowl there, the height of the bowl there, the height of the bowl there. These two are pretty much sane although these two are still very low so the delivery rates on these two when the jets are set will be pretty low so they have to be done as well. This one is probably suspect and we'll show you later but it's possibly that that one's leaking and is filled with petrol and has gone way down. So there we go. Here we have the carburetor off the car after many words that you won't hear in the Bible. Um, awkward, awkward things take off as is normal with a Jaguar. Pins and things put into places that no mortal man would ever think of putting them in, but anyway, here we have the jet. So the jet, as you can see, is utterly corroded all the way down its stem. As a comparison, there's the new version, and that's what that one should look like. Uh, even when they're worn, they're normally still very brassy. This one has been soaked in water, and there's the offending spring, as you can see, corroded lost its elasticity nasty little thing and it held the this little jet here way down in the base of this unit here which um i'll show you how corroded it is so this normally would zip up and down here quite freely but this you can't even get the thing in it's out but it's incredibly corroded so the jet and seat has to come out and then the oh, I've got it stuck now it's um tremendously corroded but it's been like this for a very long time and it's been soaked in water so this is what happens when you put a car in storage be warned so there you go so um next part of this is to rebuild the thing using new parts video to follow